Well, here's a name that's a bit of a blast from the past, IBM ThinkPad. So this is actually a machine that hasn't been turned on probably for at least two years, if not longer. Um, it's the, uh, the actual the laptop I was using more than a decade ago uh, at work. It's an IBM ThinkPad T30. So this predates IBM's sale to Lenovo. And I'm going to turn it on for the first time. And I'm recording this because I want to see what happens uh, to this. So I've got alongside us some more modern devices uh, to see what we think of that. But anyway, this is a ThinkPad T30. If I open the lid, we can see the keypad. Yeah, this is typical IBM, I suppose. And I've had it charging for the last um, 20 or 30 minutes. It's actually been in a cupboard uh, in the attic uh, for all this time, just sitting there. And so I have no idea what's going to happen when we turn it on. Um, it, last time I turned it on, if I recall, it had updated. It's running Windows Professional, uh, Windows XP Professional. And the last time I turned it on, it was connected to a network. And it did do some updates, if I recall. But we'll see. So I'm going to turn it on. And the on switch is that one. Let's see what happens. We've got some illuminating thing. Aha, here we go. Wow, look at that. It started up. I'm, I'm actually quite astonished. Uh, why should I be astonished? I think I am. There we go. haven't seen that for a long, long time. That kind of startup screen compared to what you get now. And that's pretty impressive after all this time of just being sitting in a closet. So uh, it'll probably take a while. But this was the workhorse machine that I used, as I mentioned, well over a decade ago. If I recall its spec, uh, a Pentium 4 processor, a gig of memory... Um, I think a 60 gig hard drive, which is actually a lot for the time, um, a recordable CD uh, player and writer, and also uh, two or three um, card slots. Yep, look at that. And so I'm going to click on my login, because that's MD, that was my dad, and I'm still got a login here. Let's see what happens when I load that. So welcome, it welcomes me. And loading my personal settings, it says. Yeah, it takes. Wow, that tune. Haven't heard that for a long time either. So, so it works, and yeah, it's slow. Although, is it really that slower than um, uh, Windows Seven on some machines? Like my desktop machine seems a bit slow to me. So, yeah, the default Windows note, uh, uh, wallpaper. Um, not how it was when I was using the machine a decade ago, but uh, uh, I think I set this all up when I set it up for my dad to use it, and I defaulted everything, as it were. So the icons we can see are, well, typical uh, ones we've got here. But, here we go. It hasn't run the security scan for a long time, so it's alerting me that the computer might be at risk. And um, it, let me shut that because there's a, there's a text on the screen. What is that, I wonder? Okay, it's not, okay, we've got to click on that. Okay, it's, yeah, it's not got any network, so it's not doing that. It's telling me, yeah, I know, gosh, that used to be so annoying with XP, wasn't it? So it's actually telling me the version, Service Pack 3, so it is pretty... Bang up to date. Okay, it's detecting a Wi-Fi. I don't really have time to uh, to um, configure that right now. I just want to see what happened when I turn it on. So after a couple of years at least of sitting in a cupboard, uh, not being connected to a power source, nothing at all, and not being turned on, uh, no activity with this device whatsoever, uh, I plug it in, uh, charge it for a bit, and it may well have been unnecessary to do that, and I turn it on, and voila. It works, and uh, it's pretty impressive. A testament, I think, to the quality of build that IBM put into these machines. And these, as I said, were the workhorses in corporate environments. I still see lots of Lenovo devices around. And indeed, if I went, if I go to the Lenovo website, which I did, uh, it gives me the spec for the ThinkPad T30, which is this device. Um, and of course, it was built by IBM at the time. So this dates from 2001 or so. Uh, when I got the machine, it was in 2001, it was brand new. So uh, there we have it, an IBM T30 ThinkPad.
first to switch on in at least a couple of years.